Let me show you how easy it is to remove backdrop from your image using Pixelmator Pro. I already load my image, as you can see it's rather large, 8000 pixels high. So to remove the backdrop, simply head to the top right corner. You will see this button over here. Remove the backdrop from the current selected layer. So be sure the layer is selected and click this button. Now the program will analyze your image and then quickly remove the backdrop and it's done. Let's zoom in a bit to inspect how good it is. As you can see, we got the backdrop out from this area. So that's the areas that are kind of surrounded by the subject of the image and some programs may skip them. In this case, it's removed. So that's a good thing. Over here, we got a bit of backdrop trap in between her legs. And as you can see, it's kind of didn't decide well on this floor here. So it's kind of a dirt here, multiple colors together. So it's not a perfect cut for the floor. But over here, when we got a bit blur backdrop, we got a nice sharp cut. And like always a challenging area that's the hair so let's zoom in even closer i would say it's it's rather good we got even semi-transparency over here something's missing here so it seems like it's removed a bit too much in this area but overall it's a really solid background remover alternatively we could head to edit and select select and mask option in this option everything that is kind of marked with this yellow color will be kind of masked out we can click here select subject to select the person automatically but more than that now we got control with the brush so now i can use the brush to mark certain areas i got plus and minus mode so if this area is not selected i can use this minus mode to also make it yellow make it highlighted so i will be sure this area is gone as well in opposite this area should not be selected so i'm using the plus brush we can finish up with the smart refine take a look at that way better all right now it's time for the final inspection let's search for challenging areas before we notice that this area was not removed so let's use the minus all right and now i want to set up the output i choose new layer with a mask click apply and in this case, we will end up with the full size image with a mask on it. Mask can be later modified. So this is non-destructive method. So it's recommended if you plan for more editing on this image. So now you know how easy it is to get rid of the backdrop using Pixelmator Pro. I hope this short tutorial was helpful. I will see you in the next lesson.